Hey, good morning, guys. Uh, so I just wanted to quickly go over this interesting uh, interlinking tool I put together uh, in just a few minutes on uh, OpenAI Open uh, assistance. So if you're not using this yet, this is a precursor to the GPTs uh, and OpenAI just kind of released this without telling anybody. I was working on it yesterday. I did build it, some really basic tools. And again, this is really basic. I'm still just uh, figuring it out. But I just want to show you guys <coughs> what I put together here. So I'm just updating this post uh, for my project site. This is New Brunswick. I have the post together. I rewrote all the content. And of course, the uh, internal links are missing. So what I've done here, uh, and again, this is just the first iteration. So there will be there will definitely be an easier way to do this. Basically, I put together a tool, uh, an assistance tool. Uh, so you are a tool, you can see the prompt here. You are a tool that will help with internal linking for my website. You'll be provided with a blog post title. Um, you have access to all the links on the website below, right? And then in the instructions, I provided all the URLs on the site. Uh, based on the blog post title, so I'll show you in a second what it, what it, what it outputs. I shared the title. Uh, you will choose three to five other posts to link to that are relevant or even tangentially relevant. So you're kind of giving uh, ChatGPT, it's just giving it discretion here to choose the content. The problem I had trouble with was for the output. So your output will be the URL that, that we want to link to, that I want to link to and the anchor text. So I'll show you what happened, but the output, the outcome is, is pretty good. Uh, format the list in paragraph form. This was an update and then I had to add a second update here to format it in bullet point form. So what was happening, it was giving me this chart, right? after adding the title and then after the third iteration it finally gave me this uh you want to turn on code interpreter so that it can read the urls uh and just kind of give you the output you're looking for and then also the 1106 model the latest model so for internal linking super easy right um with the prompt being the title so the prompt is the the title is the cost of the new house and i don't remember everything i wrote about uh, on the page and I think you can use maybe Link Whisper or something, but this is just a really simple way to, to add some internal links because the problem with a lot of content, especially on this site, and this is gonna be really helpful for me, is if you go through any of your sites and you're using Yoast, or you can use Screaming Frog for this, is if you sort by internal links in the posts, like most of mine, a lot of the posts on my site don't even have internal links, right? There's quite a few pages of posts without internal links. So these are just orphan pages. You don't want that. Anyway, so for this post, I added the, the title and it gave me the actual links, right? So cost of the house in New Brunswick, which is what the post is about. It's completely fine that it added, gave me this, but then it gave me a few more affordable living, which is related to the cheapest places to live, relocating. So I'm moving to New Brunswick. You can see in the bottom left of the URL, uh, alternative building materials. And it gave me a ship of containers for sale uh, in New Brunswick post. That's really cool. And then overall living experience in New Brunswick, um, living in New Brunswick post. Did it do that twice? No. So now you're gonna to have to go ahead and add that to the content. What I'm thinking of doing now uh, with this tool is, is I guess at maybe adding a second part or building a second assistant where you can then just paste this into the uh, tool and then it will just give you the output rather than me now having to go through and find out exactly where to add this. It just is gonna give me a little bit more control of the internal link placement. But just right off the bat and really quickly guys, really it's like super cool way to, uh, super easy way to start um, improving internal linking and getting this, uh, getting these kind of posts finally up on the site and building the internal links uh, for the content that you already have, especially if like mine, you don't have, there's a lot of content without internal links. So yeah, first iteration, I'm actually gonna head out now and try to figure out how to have this added to the content directly. Uh, but yeah, I hope you guys are playing with assistance. Let me know if you've had a chance to try it out. As always, you guys, thank you for watching and we'll see you in the next video.